Karen Palmer, Believe Land Media here with David Bukarski from West G Football. Going into your senior season, you played varsity before. Tell me what you're going to take from the previous seasons and add to this season. Well, um, last season I didn't start varsity at the very start of the year. Um, it, were, it happened midway through the season. I took for granted that I was a junior and I thought I was just going to start. So I'm not taking anything for granted this year. I'm working as hard as I can every day, acting like I'm not going to start varsity, just doing everything I can, trying to make my – me and myself, uh, my teammates, as perfect as possible for this upcoming season. And so, just kind of give me some goals for this season as we're winding down mini camps. Um, well, we got a lot of tough games this year as a team. We're playing Shard in week one. Uh, we're playing what Lutheran West. We're playing a lot of extremely uh, difficult teams. So I want to have a winning record by the end of the year. Um, that's just my main goal for the team. Just kind of talk about the offseason that has been as we're winding down as week one starts next week. Um, I think this year the seniors are taking a bigger leadership role. Last year uh, the seniors we had have been part of that one seven and four uh, season uh, like two years ago and they took winning for granted. Um, so they weren't nearly as focused on trying to play as a team. Uh, this year I think our seniors we went two and eight last year so our seniors are a lot more focused on winning and having a team mentality, so I think we'll be a lot better in that respect. Thank you. Karen Palmer, Believe Land Media here with Carson Wiseman from West G Football. Senior season, you played varsity the past couple seasons. What are you going to take from these past couple years to add to this season? We're going to definitely amp up our energy and take, since it's my senior year, take it really as, you know, if we're done after this. So we're going to go in with full energy, full um like not to get anything for granted and we're just going to show the people that we're not a, a joke program you know coming off a tough season and we're just going to fight tell me about some goals for the season personal and team goals uh personal goals i want to get the interception record uh i'm five away uh i'm at six the 11 to tie maybe 12 even to break and then last question it's your senior season what is it going to take for you guys to show people who you really are and be the underdog that you you're poised to be we used to have to play together as a team last year we it didn't seem like we wanted to be there we weren't rallying this year we want to celebrate with each other on big plays you know we're gonna it's gonna mean it's gonna take a lot because with this new schedule we are adding very sharp and Kenson Aurora it's gonna be a battle but we're really gonna do anything you know uh, my last year I'm may I'm looking maybe to play college but so that's also a goal, but really for a lot of people, it's going to be over. So you got to take everything and go 100. Thank you. Karen Palmer, Believe Land Media with Gabe Praza from West G Football. Going into your senior season, you played varsity the past couple of years. Just tell me what you're going to take from the previous seasons and add to this year. Uh, we got to be more intense, I feel like, because we were last year, because we had a lot of people like playing out of position. They didn't want to be there. And most of the seniors last year, they got injured, like in the first scrimmage and stuff. So we were missing a lot of our key players before the season started. You guys have a tough schedule. Shard week one, Kenson week two. A rough way to open the season, but just kind of tell me how you guys are going to come together and work through it. Um, we just got to be intense, fast off the ball. We got to like, learn from our mistakes last year that we were making. Because we put a lot more work in the weight room this offseason than we did the previous year. Just give me some personal and team goals for the season. Uh, personal goal, I want to make sure that the younger guys are prepared to like to make them better than this season so they could like, be better the future seasons and stuff, so prepare them. And team goals, I want to try and make the playoffs again like we did my sophomore year. Thank you. Karen Palmer, Believe Land Media, here with Josh Sessler from West Chicago Football. You're going into your junior season. You played a little bit of varsity snaps last year as a sophomore. What are you going to take from that? those minimal snaps to add into this season? One thing I learned was even when it's last minute of the game, overtime, fourth quarter, everyone's always going 100%. You have to be ready. There's no gas. can't be gassed. You have to be ready to go. And so I want to ask, what are, what are you looking to build leading into your senior year as you have one more year left after this? I definitely want to work on my strength, and I also want to work on my speed on the line to get up faster and get in, in the tents. What are some big goals you have for yourself and the team? 
this season? Lose. I really want to lose weight so I can become in a better shape, and I really want the season to prosper, and I want us to get a better record, and not me to be, be the best player, but everyone do, and everyone can grow. That way it can prosper longer when everyone goes. Thank you. Palmer, believe I made it here with Matt Rosati from West Chicago Football. Coach, winding down the offseason, just kind of tell me what you're looking forward to this year. Well, we're looking to uh, improve. We have a really, really good group of guys that want to work hard and, and we want to try to get better every single day. What are some goals that you are, are setting with your team for this season? We want to be competitive in every football game we play and uh, we want to make the state playoffs. You had a tough year last year. How are you going to take from what you learned last year and apply it to this season and get better? Well, we're... Uh, uh, we're working hard. We've had a good off season, and uh, the guys are very committed. And uh, our plan is to get better. Thank you, coach.